Hello, my friends. My name is Patrick Smith, head of growth marketing here at Flamel AI. Very excited today to walk you through a comprehensive overview of all of the features that we boast on this powerful platform. Now, if you are looking for a deep dive on the AI engine, the foundation that powers our platform, this is not that video. This is the high level bird's eye view of every feature. All of it, we will not be diving into the nitty gritty, the granular secret sauce of the AI. That would be this video, I'll link it here in a second. However, we are gonna be talking about the platform at large and all the awesome stuff you can do with the growing, yet still extremely powerful from AI platform. Starting here, right? Right in the homepage, bird's eye view, like we talked about, of everything you need to know. So a little getting started area over here, some what's new, and we are actively updating this with new features as they come out. As you can see, the top one here is our Canva integration, which just was released a couple months ago. So anytime you're like, hey, I wonder if there's any new features, it's right here on your homepage, very convenient. You can also see, hey, how much do we have going out this week, right? So right now we see a big fat zero. That, if I'm a social media manager, brand manager, that's gonna be an issue. I'm gonna to wanna to go straight to calendar and start to create some posts, right? Also, we can see how many posts are awaiting our approval, which if we're the ones, you know, we're the bottleneck, we need to approve some posts so they can get scheduled and get out. Great thing to be able to see very quickly as soon as you enter the platform. And of course we have our, hey, um, little inspiration for you, National and Pinata Day. Why not create a post about it? So bird's eye view, what's new, what you need to get started, and then what do you got going on? Great space for the home. Uh, the calendar view, this is arguably the most important view in any social media builder, which I think ours is extremely intuitive. We can see the week. We can also see the month. And as you can see here, we have um, an order of gradient, draft, pending approval, ready, posted. So we can see this one has been posted. This one, however, you know, uh, is passed, so it's grayed out. But if we add a new post here, we can see, okay, these are drafts, these are pending approval, these are ready these are posted, right? So just again, bird's eye view, top level of what we have going on from a social perspective, either this week or this month. Obviously, if we see, okay, we need some more content for the rest of the week, we can dive into the post creator here. And while we're in here, let's talk about the features in the post creator. Uh, folders for your media, you can upload media as well. You can generate media with AI, a really cool feature that we dive into in the AI engine video. But for now, wildly customizable there's not anything else like this on the marketplace in terms of social media you can even go as far to add custom options or adjust the design obviously we got our post preview over here with our standard customizable look at that post real story that's big time right there with our standard uh you know preview and different channels we can post to caption as well we can keep a library of captions if we have one that does well or we can keep a library of prompts if we have a prompt that consistently outputs great captions for our brand hey maybe worth creating a folder and throwing them in here just to have or you know to empower your franchisees social media managers clients whatever uh just to easily access and to create high, high quality content with so Editing in the caption itself, we can go into the caption body, we can add a CTA, we can adjust the tone just like we can when it comes to the media. So we can do both the media and the copy can be aligned with our brand and can all be created via AI. Again, we dive into that in the AI video, but a great feature to have. Automations, we could have some today's holidays, right? It can show you, hey, it's a pinata day, it's National Zoo Lovers Day, it's National All Is Ours Day. You can add a CTA, you can also sit here and generate captions based on the today's holidays that we provide for you, a very powerful feature as well. And if one of these three isn't good enough for you, guess what, we have a thousand more down here, right? So lots of options, just empowering social media management creators to create in a frictionless way, right? And that's the goal with Flamel. The features that we give you, the goal is to make this smooth and efficient without sacrificing any of the quality that you would get, you know, where you're not using AI, where you're not using this tool, where you just do it in the old fashioned way, right? And I think that's the mark of a really great tool. I would be remiss to not mention the robust, robust, and I'm, this media editor is crazy. I have never ever seen a media editor this robust, this comprehensive anywhere anywhere that is not you know a standalone design tool and very quickly let's just so i can show you we'll grab a stock image we'll take this one so i'm going to add that 
we're gonna see that populate over here on the right. We can go down here, we can do whatever we want with this thing. It's crazy. Decorate, crop, fine tune, right? Exposure, temperature, gamma, vignette, filter, stickers. We can add, you know, custom branded stickers to this image. We can do so many different things. We can resize it, which is also big, you know, depending on which platform we're posting to. So again, this massive, robust, just comprehensive feature filled media editor, all these four pillars combined to form what I think is the greatest social media or, you know, content creation interface that I have used in my many years as a social media marketer and a growth marketing leader. So media, uh, we already saw some of that. This is going to be a design hub just for exactly that, you know, uploading libraries, organizing media into folders. Um, again, all of your captions or prompts can be in folders here. A Giphy integration in case, you know, you don't have a graphic designer on staff or they're out of office and you need to do something or you just want to throw a little spice into what you're doing from a content perspective. GIFs are always great for that as well. So that's a feature that I use a lot. Again, design is going to pull us into both our workspace, both our workspace and an exploratory area where we can go in here and we can just find templates, right? Again, removing friction from the content creation process. If you're struggling to think of an idea, you're not a designer, you're like, what do we do? We can build all of these templates in here for, you know, centralized hubs, for one-off franchises, for clients, for anything, right? Essentially just giving you access to the work you've already created that succeeded and allowing you to repurpose that to, again, just, just operate more efficiently from a content creation standpoint. Because when you operate more efficiently, you operate more consistently. And consistency really is the name of the game when it comes to, you know, social success, especially top funnel. So moving on, Let's talk about campaigns, a extremely important feature filled with AI, probably the most powerful feature on our platform. I'm a little biased because I love to use AI to build campaigns. We're not going to talk about that here. We're going to show that it's possible. Go check out the AI engine video if you want to learn how to build campaigns with AI. What we're going to do is show the robust manual campaign builder, which allows for us to very quickly manually you know, color code our campaigns, add a name in there. We can pick the days we want to post on. So maybe I got a little spring campaign going. I want to just, I want to post on these days, right? Pull that out. Oh, wait a minute. Oh no. Uh, let's pick a new duration, right? So down here to here, color, spring. And we're going to do it through the calendar, right? As opposed to recurring, we can add timing slots here. But what I want to do is the calendar. I want to post on Wednesday saturday on wednesday on friday on sunday there and then there so spring campaign we're going to color it green for growth for spring we got the days we want we're going to build this sucker and look at this we got our folders we got our media right here we can see all the posts that we have planned they're all in draft form right so we can go in here and we can just build them out one by one and when we go back once all these posts are finished, voila, we will have a robust campaign easily built out seamlessly using the manual builder within uh, Flamel AI. We can also edit all of them. We can schedule them all. Maybe we have, hey, this campaign is canceled, it's delayed, whatever, unschedule them all. Little nuggets of features that really just make your life easier. Uh, that's a big thing about our product here, right? Is it was designed by marketers for marketers. I had a heavy hand and I still do in the product iteration roadmap. And I'm somebody who has been in all these platforms and done the research and I know what the pain points are. And so uh, that's an advantage of ours is, you know, just little things like that, that we understand the nuance of what you need, of what your pain points are and how we can address those, right? And so we've talked about creation, we've talked about campaigns, design, all the awesome things you can do in Flamel, but what about the results of our efforts here? Analytics, any social media manager, brand manager, CMO will tell you it is wildly important that whatever tool you're using has an analytical presence that you can use it to see what's working what's not working and most importantly you can export these analytics because if you're social media manager you're managing brands 99 times out of 100 you're reporting up maybe weekly bi-weekly monthly you're going and meeting with you know your direct report maybe the board the c-suite whatever it looks like social media everyone is asking hey what are the impacts of our social media efforts and it can be difficult when you don't have analytics here to to even show that to show hey this is the work that i'm doing this is how it's moving the needle and that's really important right and so as you can see here we have all of our social platforms and then everything we need to see from a bird's eye view here impressions engagements two of the most important metrics in social and then all of these are visualized down here 
um, on this graph, you can see, okay, we got a lot of impressions on Instagram, not as many on LinkedIn, kind of see where those impressions are sourcing from. Channels, maybe we should lean into more, lean into less. We can also see reach, right? Overall reach, how many people, right? Impressions is just general view is the same person. You can see it a hundred times, it'll count them a hundred times. Reach is people. So these are unique impressions, very important metric. And then of course, profile views, right? Profile views, that means that your content was compelling enough that it made someone think, hmm, I want to learn more about you or your business or such and such, right? And so sort of a top-down analysis here. Impressions are top funnel reach would be like, you know, middle, upper funnel, and then profile bottom to low. And so everything you need here again, just to get a bird's eye view on what's working, what's not. And then like we talked about the shareability, it's a huge factor. Uh, you can come in here analytics and we're going to talk to you about right here, right? Impressions, what's working, what's not. Audience, what's working, what's not. Engagements overall activity, right? And so what's really cool too, and this is actually an AI feature I didn't get into in the AI engine video, so I'll talk about it now. Um, you can use Luna, which is an AI tool proprietary to Femel, where we can go in there. It's gonna analyze your data. If you're not a data person, I know a lot of us, you know, creative social media marketers, content creators, we're not necessarily math data people. Luna will do that for you. Luna will do the boring stuff for you and it'll analyze all your data and it'll give you insights that you can copy and paste or adjust into your own voice. And then you can pass up to your higher ups, to your direct reports and say, look, this is what's working, this is what's not. And that's all done for you again, making it a frictionless experience, right? Look at this, LinkedIn on the other hand, saw its highest impressions on this day. We can go to that day, we can say this post, what post was that? Why did it work so well? How can we replicate that, right? There are fluctuations in the data, content time, posting time. Also, additional efforts can be made to increase LinkedIn activity, post more frequently or during peak times, right? So recommendations for you through Luna. Um, you can come in here and you can even customize this report. You can include impressions, remove them if you don't care, audience, et cetera, et cetera. And then once we're happy with this report, like I said, shareability, we can come in here. We can download it as a PDF very quickly. There it goes. Pop it open and look at this. We can see everything. We can pass this up to our direct report or whomever we need to be held accountable with and things will be great, right? So this has been a high level overview of all of the features you can find in Flamel. Again, if you want a deep dive on the AI aspect of our platform, this video is great for you, go check it out. However, this one is gonna cover, again, bird's eye view of, of what we do from a feature perspective. So thank you for being here. My name is Patrick Smith, head of growth marketing at Flamel AI. Please reach out to me. Connect with me on LinkedIn. Connect with Paul, our CEO, Zach, our lead BD. We'd be very happy to get on a call, walk you through the platform, schedule a demo, get you hooked up with a free trial, just so you can see the power of Flamel and you can begin to understand, you know, the impact it can have on you, on your content creation process, and your bottom line, right? Because at the end of the day, social media, top funnel, directly attributed to revenue. And that's a bridge that not many of us see. That's a bridge that Flamel is building and that we're hoping more and more people will realize can exist uh, through the power of this, this robust platform. So thank you for your time. Like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, turn on that bell for more notifications because we're creating a lot of video content and we're gonna try to keep you all updated on everything Flamel as often as possible here on our YouTube and elsewhere. So again, thank you for the time. Have a great rest of your day. Go forth and ignite the fire of your social media using Flamel AI.